know he didn't seem rude when I didn't talk to Sir Terry early on. It's just that I know that we have a little surprise planned for Terry. Uh, not too big a surprise. We, we don't want to finish him off, no. Um, <laughs> come with me back to 1959, oh, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> when a young man made his first ever broadcast from a Dublin post office. He then helped to create Radio 1 and Radio 2 and for 27 years has presented The Breakfast Show, THE Breakfast Show, to an audience of nearly 10 million people with effortless charm and unique wit. Oh, shut up. Yeah, it's all true. <laughs> he, he retires from that show next Friday. You're not getting rid of him, though, that easily, because he'll still be there on a Sunday morning and, of course, children in need. But he is, I think, the undisputed master of this medium, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I mean that. And I've studied and stolen from the best. After 50 years as the country's greatest and favourite broadcaster, it gives me enormous pleasure. It is also genuinely, it's a terrific honour for me to be asked to give to Sir Terry this special Lifetime Achievement Award for radio broadcasting to Sir Terry Wogan. Ladies and gentlemen, it's been a journey. <laughs> uh, this only sustains my long felt theory that in our business, if you can stay upright and reasonably sober, <laughs> they'll give you something in the end. <laughs> now, I know very well. This is the... I don't believe he's going of his own accord, but give him something <laughs> so that he doesn't come back. <laughs> and I shall take this with me and, and cover it always and back to the, the home for the bewildered. <laughs> the home for infirm and indigent disc jockeys. <laughs> my little room there. Put it beside my tooth mug beside Jimmy Young's room. <laughs> Actually, they'd reserve the room I'm taking for you, but... <laughs> you, you somehow redeemed yourself. <laughs> well, I think I'll... That's my award this year. Ladies and gentlemen, congratulations to the fabulous Sir Terry Wogan. <laughs> Sir Terry Wogan. The one and only, there will never be another, the master.